Welcome to Windsor College. My name is Sahida Khan and I am one of the business teachers here at the college. We would have loved to welcome you in person to um, the college, but sadly this year we won't be able to do that. Uh, so I've put together a short clip to try and address some of the points. The PowerPoint will tell you a bit about the course overall um, and will introduce the core text and also have a look at a summary assignment which has been included for you to have a go at. If you do have any questions, my contact details can be found at the end of this presentation. So on to the next slide, which is a common asked questions. Um, obviously there, could, there would be um, a number of questions that you would want answering, so I'll just go through a few of the main ones. Um, how you will be assessed within the two years is there's four examination units, two you would be doing in the first year, two in the second year, and there are nine assignment based units, and within those nine there are seven that, that are mandatory. Generally the class sizes uh, for this BTEC course um, are usually around 13 to 19, but again that could depend on how many we get um, enrolled and how many are interested. Um, there are there is homework obviously with any course that um, you you take there is homework um, and that is mainly uh, linked to your assignments mainly linked to your revision guides and your research um, of course we try and organize um, external visits um, also internal speakers as much as we can um, and if you have any other questions please you can always just email me So what units will you be studying? As I mentioned on the previous slide, there are 13 units which need to be completed within the two years. Uh, four of these units are exam based. Um, in the first year, the exam based units are developing a marketing campaign and personal finance. Um, and the remainder units that you would do, um, an example could be international business, managing an event, um, exploring business, um, and these are the mandatory units which need to be completed. As a college, we require all students to come prepared and ready to learn. So we would expect you, as any um, educational setting, you to have the necessary resources, such as your pen, papers, a file where you would put all your, um, all your information, and have all these ready for you to start in September. I've also uh, put the textbook, which is a Pearson and Beta National Business book. There is two student books, student one and student two, um, and these would be quite useful um, uh, to purchase perhaps if you could, um, and these would be helpful um, over the next two years. So what can you do to prepare? I have put some links on this slide uh, which I think would be useful for you to click on and have a look at some of the resources that would help you to prepare and be ready to start this course in September. Um, I think it would be useful to have a look at these links um, and read through some of the resources in terms of the core textbook and there's a revision guide for the exams for you to look through.
finally, I would um, like you to spend some time uh, during the summer to look through uh, the BTEC specification. As part of your summer assignment, um, I thought it would be good for you to explore the BTEC site and have a look at the specification, have a look at what units um, you are going to be studying. And I would like you to create um, an electronic business folder uh, with all the information that you have gathered from looking at the BTEC site and having a look at the BTEC specification for this course. I have attached a link on the PowerPoint, the next PowerPoint, uh, and I would like you to familiarise familiarise yourself with the specification and the units, um, and perhaps have a look at what units you think would be interesting for yourself. And good luck on this one, and I look forward to seeing this uh, hopefully um, in September.